Welcome, Sarts Geniuses, to the final question on this paper. Now, seeing as it's the final question, you would expect it to be a little bit more difficult than some of the other questions, but with a little bit of thought, we can easily get there. Now, this is going to be a multi-step problem, so it's going to take us more than one step to get the final answer. Now, we've got two different cuboids going on here. We've got Amina's cuboid, which is the one that we can see, which is 6 by 4 by 3 and then we've got Stefan making a different cuboid that's five longer, five centimetres taller and five centimetres wider than the one that we can see. And we're being asked for what is the difference between the number of cubes in Amina's and Stefan's cuboid. So we're being asked for the difference in volume. Now you should know that the volume of a cuboid is the length times the width times the height. Now you can't really count all of the cubes on here because some of them are at the back of the cuboid, so you can't actually see them all anyway. So we need to find this different way and use the different way. Now the different way is going to be to do the length times the width times the height. So let's replace L, W and H with the numbers. So we've got 6 is the length, 3 is the width going backwards, and the height is obviously going to be 4. So 6 times 3, that's 18. Now times that by 4. If you can't do that in your head, you'll need to use a little column method. So 18 times 4, no harm in doing that. 4 times 8 is 32, put the 2 in, carry the 3. 4 times 1 is 4, plus the 3 is 7. So that makes 72. So Amina's cuboid must be 72 centimetres cubed. Okay, so now we need to figure out what Stefan's cuboid is going to be. But we get some measurements. So Stefan's cuboid is going to be five longer well five longer than six six plus five is eleven so stefan's cuboid is going to be eleven long it's going to be five centimeters taller so that's going to be this four plus five because this is the height so four plus five is nine so it's going to be nine high and it's going to be five centimeters wider so we need to add five to the three as well and three plus five is eight so Stefan's cuboid is basically going to be 11 times 9 times 8. Okay? So if we work that out, multiply the three measurements together, we'll get Stefan's cuboid. So 11 times 9 is 99. Then we need to times that by 8. So again, quick column method. 99 multiplied by 8. 8 nines is 72. Put the 2 in, carry the 7. 8, 9 to 72 again, 72 plus 7 is 79. So Stefan's cuboid is 792 centimetres cubed. Now, as you can see, even though we've only added 5 centimetres onto each of the three measurements, it's actually made quite a big difference because Amina's was 72 centimetres cubed, that was her volume, and Stefan's is 792 centimetres cubed. Now we've got one last step to do, and it did say to find the difference. So the difference between 792, 792 and 72 is when you subtract the 72. Let's just work that out. 2 take away 2 is nothing. 9 take away 7 is 2. And 7 take away nothing is 7. So the final answer is 720 cubes. So again, it's a multi-step problem. There's a few steps to do there, but with a little bit of clear thinking and remembering that a cuboid is length times width times height, you should be able to figure it out. Final answer, 720.